accelerators have been one of the most accessible technologies this generation. Varieties of calculators come in hand, which may the lots facile. Hey guys, it's Tech Media, and today's special episode series, which I will be about calculators. I have three calculators with me, and what I have right now is the 85 ES Plus, 991 ES Plus, and the most modern calculator to this generation, what many people use is 991 EX Plus. Obviously, this the one you're looking at right now in my hand is the 85 ES Plus, and these are one of the three calculators I have right now. There must be four actually. I think I lost the other one, but let's get back to the topic. This is the 85 ES Plus. This is one of the three calculators obviously in my hand. But for this video, I would like to dig deeper. Many people think this calculator is just a normal technology, but no. Let's dig deep. Let's dig deeper into this calculator. This is the 85 ES Plus calculator and it is one of the best selling calculators across the nation with, and it's still used until now. It has a two-way power which is the solar power and the battery power and there are new functions I would like to introduce which are like the prime factorizations and time to integers if we didn't knew. But these calculators are also used in other modern calculators which is the 991 ES Plus and the 991 EX Plus. These new functions are the prime factorizations and random integers. Every calculator has that and we know there is letter A, letter B, letter C, letter D, letter E, letter F, letter X, letter Y and letter M. It is all the statistics needed for every student like the list based statistic, standard deviation and more which comes with a hard case which I probably don't have it. Sorry about that. It also has a 10 plus 2 digit. What does the 10 plus 2 digit, digit mean? It means that there are like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 and that 10, the 0, they consider as 10 of course. So these digits are known to be the 10 mantisa digits. And there are two exponential di dis digits, sorry, two exponential digits with a dot matrix display. That, that because of the dot matrix display, it has, it has a very high resolution which makes the graphics Beautiful. Um, it is also quick and easy to recall for the previous answer being executed. So, for example, like as you can see, it's 98. Wait, can you see? Yeah, 98 plus 98. So, probably you want to get this value, but then you're not sure that why is it coming 196. So, what you can do, probably you made a mistake. So, what you can do, you can click the button here, delete 99, and then you get a different value. Now um, every calculator has that, not only this calculator, so that doesn't mean this calculator is the best. I never said this calculator is the best. They also have plastic keys. Now what do you mean by plastic keys? These all are plastic, they're not metallic of course. So which means they're not fragile or they're not hard to use. They, they, it makes it easier to use, just like other calculators. You can also create a numerical table based on its uh, expression. Registering, registering a function expression. So function expression is that f of x, I think. Yeah, not I think. What the heck? In addition, graph functions can also be done where, of course, it can be represented by the graph having all the basic statistics like the sum, which is also known as addition. Add, subtract, multiply, divide. These are one of the basic statistics, standard deviation, and so many other mathematical operations with basic functions and list-based stat by the data editor. Do know is that obviously many people use calculators, but this calculator what I'm holding right now it can be used in lower years. I don't know if you guys use use calculators from the start of secondary because obviously I don't know the world school. Come on, like, like I study in a school, but I don't know what other schools follow. So what I believe, I think, I think if they use calculator, most of the time they can use this calculator because they do need to really jump to on. 991 ES plus or 991 EX plus, but there is a catch. 
since many people does not want to spend much on their calculator like he's spending a lot of money on the calculator what they can do they can directly buy 991 es plus yes they can buy this but if it of course rich enough you can also buy this than this and obviously like this but it's better if you rather buy this rather than rather than both of them together and it's also a budget calculator and it's easy to use since all the calculators are budget calculator except for this this was expensive um it's also easy to use and it of course makes life easier if any one of you thought that 85 es plus was good yes it's good but this is better i'm not trying to rank in order obviously but this is what many people use it. this is like the most popular calculator this is used but not much compared to this since this has less functions and this of course let's talk about functions now features and functions of this calculator is there are new functions in this calculator which is the new equation mode and of course the random integer as i said earlier that every calculator has their own i mean every calculator has the random integer which is a common thing in every calculator if we talk about the standard functions, they have a fraction calculations, of course. They have a combination and permu per permutation. Now, the combination and permutation is not available here. Since the function of this is so less, that it's not available here, but here. Now, th this is the reason why, and we'll talk about that later in this video. Um, there are also statistics like every other calculator has, like the STAT and the list-based list based STAT standard deviation and regression analysis they have all the nine variables which is a b c d e f x y and m they also come with a new slide thank god i have a new slide now they have all the functions uh, what this calculator has and all the other 82 es plus and the 350 es plus fun functions have thing is i don't have those apart from 85 es plus so as i said earlier they have all the functions what do what 85 ES plus have but in addition you can't in 85 ES plus you can't do something which is matrix calculation you can't do matrix calculation or vector calculation because the the function here is limited it's too broad it's too broad which means not much people would love to use this calculator especially when they go to exams it won't help them much and which means they end up failing not really failing but then you know like get the grade they don't deserve why because they don't this calculator does not have the functions they need compared to this calculator what i'm holding right now in my left hand they have the equation calculators all the um, uh, integration and the differential calculators matrix calculation vector calculation and the calc function the calc, calc function is this one if you think about it here you see the calc yeah so they have that function compared to this they don't have it okay they also have solve function okay before jumping if you notice or no there's the abs x cube x to the power minus one and the log what they have here here we catch calc the the dy over dx function x to the power minus one function and log function the difference here is that abs is here and x cube is here but here is calc and the, the dy over dx function now if we try to if the difference over here is like too obvious because they have this calculator here has all the functions needed compared to the 85 es plus so uh, let's move on the specifications of this calculator is that it is of course non-programmable since it is already programmed inside the calculator because you don't need to program it again and again the the tech, the tech here the calculator here is already been programmed and is executed but your only goal is to only job is to like of course hit the keys 
Now functions again this has 252 functions but this has 417 functions is so almost double and of course every calculator has a natural textbook display as usual it's too common they also have 10 digit mantisa and 2 digit exponential display with the dot matrix and multi replay okay what's multi replay again we as we have said in the previous video multi replay is like you made an error as i've showed earlier 98 plus 98 okay i'll show you here again so it's like 98 plus 98 so you made a mistake then click this thing here click 9 and then you get a different value uh, it's of course two-way two-way power which is the solar here and the sorry the hard case here and the battery here can you see the screw here yeah yeah the screw is there so it's solar and battery with plastic keys designed and it's for easy operate it's engineered for easier operation all the ba basic mathematical functions is there like trigonometric exponential and logarithms since as this calculator also has the basic mathematical function so why not this calculator it also has a, has a table gener table generation where you can create a numerical table based on a specific expression and um, they have a base n calculator that's one difference they have a base n calculator they have scientific constants um okay just let's get a brief review on what scientific constants um i don't know if anyone of you does physics but in this video if you guys do physics i hope you guys will understand what is scientific constants so there are some equations where you tend to use like let's say any of the equation i think it's in higher classes where they give up some equations and you have to use it through a calculator since it's hard so in this calculator of course you can use so that's one one catch you can use this calculator in higher uh, years and also lower lower years if you want to buy but this is limited this you can use in lower years if you want to buy this but not in higher since they don't the 85 es plus does not have the op options like base and calculator and the scientific calculator also vectors vectors are mostly required in math i hope you learned about it and i'm sure you guys know about it uh, as you might have heard this calculator can't do vectors so sorry this calculator 991 es plus can um, of course both the calculators all the calculators have the basic statistics which is the functions uh, mean sum standard deviation and it's also a list list based uh, stat meaning you can also view and edit input in the list format of course it is a non-calculator just like any other calculator but you can also have a graphic calculator um it's quite expensive of course and i don't have it right now it is non-graphic uh, but you can also do differentiation in this calculator not 85 es plus as i said earlier the functions over there is too broad and um limited which makes it hard to do use the operations you want to really use uh apart from that there's nothing not much of a difference it's just that 991 es plus more added more more modern more functions available compared to the 85 es plus um, obviously a 991 es plus is one of the budget calculators if you guys want a more cheaper calculator but a more advanced calculator obviously 991 es plus is a very good option but for people who want to upgrade more this is the king as we say the king of all the calculators 991 ex plus now the calculators we have seen here and here try to if you have one of these calculators just follow through follow with me try to switch on a calculator click mode just mode okay if you didn't do it this is here as you can see there's comp stat equation table uh, this is 991 es plus okay just to just to remind that this calculator won't have much so that's why i'm using this calculator as you can see the formats here are in columns yeah so they have like one two three four columns as you can see here 
Um, that is what every ES plus calculators have. It's, it's it may be less less in one more in one other but what we see is that both the calculators have the same way of formatting i mean addressing the user that this which format you want to pick but this calculator has a catch so click uh if you guys have this calculator obviously you want to you would know how modern this calculator is but if you don't know if you guys don't have this calculator you can click mode think about it is in rows so the difference here, I'm using the 991 ES Plus, is that this is in columns, but this is in rows, which makes it very easy. And initiative operability where uh, it makes it easier to use for features, for especially for class width, by the use of icons and the desired functions. And one thing, this is in numbers. So you click your number, um, so if you want to click one, which is one, two is two, three is three, and so on until eight. But here, where mode, then you can also click your number. But look at the black button. Look at the black button. Am I right? You can do anything with this calculator. Um, it's much more easier to use this calculator. It's very, very effective. Very effective. You can. Mm, fully concentrated on teaching math since it's much easier and I hope people would rec I would recommend people to use this calculator if you're in higher years or the 991 ES plus if you are in a budget obviously people over here can have budget so I'm not making fun of them but if you want to really if you want to really exceed exceed in your subjects like maths or physics of course, you have to use your 991 EX, but you can also, that doesn't mean you have to buy this. No, you can also buy the 991 ES Plus because that's also a good calculator. And I think the functions over here and there is very less minute. The difference there is very less minute. So it does not matter which calculator you have between 991 ES and 991 EX. But do not buy if you are in higher years, do not buy 85 ES plus. I'm saying it again, do not buy 85 ES plus if you are in higher year. Why? Because they don't have much functions, and I'm sure many people would struggle, many people would not like you know do use the operation for what they really want to use. Um, so pretty much, of course, many people would get the grade they don't deserve. Um, for this calculator here, it's a class we see, it's not an ES plus series anymore, it's more modern now, this calculator is more modern, of course as you can see, mode is like that, um, it's much more easy to use and when you write, when you scroll to the right or down, they give it like 1 is calculate, 2 is complex, okay, sorry, sorry. 2 is complex, 3 is uh, base and 4 is what, oh sorry, or is matrix and so on as you can see the name is here I think which makes it easier to use it that's in rows and it's very easy to operate and execute the program it's also an interactive format where obviously if you want to do a quadratic equation I'm sure most of you are lazy enough to do x equal minus x equal minus b plus minus square root of b square minus 4 c divide 2a so you can do mode then click instead of clicking one or two, click A, then click two. Sorry, mode A two and then two. So you see, it's in quadratic format. Um, with that, with that said, so you can also do in 991 ES plus. That is the reason I would recommend people to either buy 991 ES plus or the unknown ex plus but here's the catch it is not necessary to buy 991 es ex plus even though you're in like year six no it is not necessary but it's up to you the viewers will have their own opinions you guys can have your own opinions but i am recommending not to buy ex plus don't jump to ex plus even though you're in just year six or year five that's a big recommendation from me but it's up to you if you want to do it please you can do it 
don't bl don't blame me okay let's move on they all have the natural textbook display as all the other calculators have like come on even an ms series has uh if you don't know what's the ms series it has i think your parents will know about it since they this is like the 19th calculator but the display is like quite bad i'm not gonna lie but the class we see is it, it, they have the te textbook display but they want to like more modern if you think about it it's like 3 root 3 by 2 plus root 2 by 3 sorry sorry root 2 3 if you click calculate you see the view here right it's too modern i don't have currently i don't have the class i mean ms calculator uh because the ms calculator i think is broken but uh, when i have it i'll surely show you um they also have they can, you, can, you know i don't know if you know this or not but this calculator cannot i mean i don't know if they can calculate simultaneous equation here but this they can which makes it much more effective but as i've said earlier the difference between es plus and ex plus is very minute why am i talking too much obviously all of the calculators are the essential functions for learning all in one as i've said earlier you can do tables using its table for a specific expression you can do it here and here and here you can do it in every calculator which is like a common thing also it is um, simple and quick um, if you want to add is very quick if you want to subtract is very quick if you want to use uh, visualize formulas it's also very quick for this for this and uh, one good thing about the 991 ex plus is that it's fast it's smooth fast it has a smooth performance what what does that mean smooth performance means that they can you know get chopped on they, they can chop chop during exams they can like proceed faster proceed faster compared to 991 es plus yes 991 es plus you can proceed but compared to ex plus but that doesn't mean i, I once again i'm saying because since the viewers might think that because of me they will they will buy this calculator they'll buy that calculator but do not even buy 991 ex plus when you're in a lower year and do not buy 85 es plus when you're in higher year that's my biggest recommendation because i'm saying because i have also experienced this situation i am saving your life and i didn't save myself I used ES plus and I ended up failing one subject. Of course, it's my uh, physics. I failed physics because I used this uh, this calculator. Um, obviously, which made it hard. And yes, I have said earlier. Now probably I'm improving. But again, one recommendation: do not use 85 ES plus. I'm saying it again: do not use 85 ES plus when you're in higher year. Okay, why why am I actually blaming? Why am I actually? forcing people to buy this calculator that calculator i really don't understand so the extensive and the advanced series now there's now there's another catch if you guys have phone you can you know what you can do this cal uh, if you can generate a qr code uh anyone, anyone who have qr code okay i think you can download it you can generate a qr code and when you generate that so you scanning a query right in this calculator you can actually answer and your answer can be displayed on a phone 991ex is such such a modern modern era well, like wow you can generate a qr code and you will get the answer in a smartphone it's not necessary i mean we no one would buy a calculator just because oh wow i can do it i can uh, scan a qr code and then done i got an answer you can't use that in exams because exams no phone is allowed the quality here is excellent excellent quality if you think about it have you seen it okay let's write a random number so you see this is the one i'm using right now 991 es plus the display here is like quite okay -ish. it's like yeah but this calculator you see the display is like smart it's very smart uh, which makes it easier for the students to um, operate and execute the answer. I mean, execute the program, of course, as answers. They have a premium content. They have a premium content. Their, their 
way of manufacturing this calculator is so nice that it makes you feel the yes i need to learn math today it feels so good it touches you like to okay not meaning like touch touch but then like it makes you feel that yes i need to study on this subject and it, it make and that that's what every manufacturer should do to make it feel more more attached to their subject and this calculator can be one of the best options since the design is so like unique compared to this and this this calculator the keys here is much more okay here the keys are much more uh, like nicer i should say nicer um and which makes the student feel that i need to work today i need to do something today and i think that's a great option by casey and the others since um KC has done a very good job by jumping from es to ex uh obviously there are also some es calculators but i'm not moving on to them i'm moving on to ex and um, i think the functions here is much more broad uh just i don't know the functions here just if you guys can know the functions i think it's through my cover there like whatever if you guys have uh, the functions just please google it and comment down how many functions does this calculator have now it comes with a big review the similarities what we know about the similarity from these three calculators which is 85 es plus as you can see 85 es plus 991 es plus and the 991 ex all three are two-way powered solar and a battery all three of them are solar powered all of them have the have common functions which is addition subtraction multiplication division sum function um sign function power function they also have a 10 digit manista mantisa sorry mantisa and two exponential function with the natural tele natural textbook display it makes it easier for every student for the program for the query to be executed and it, of course it works on the ai <laughs> and the other similarity of them is that all of them contain a hard cover which is like too obvious and you can also do fractional calculators fraction calculator if you guys want to know what's fraction calculator this this i as you can see here this is a fraction calculator every calculator can do that which makes it very easier to execute their specific query specific expression as answer they also have the nine variables which is a b c d e f x y and m um uh all of them has all the eight eight uh, variables I'm talking about 991 ES and 991 EX right now. These two have the same eight modes, but this has three. This has three modes, and these two have eight, which makes it much easier. That's what I said earlier. The difference between this and this is very minute, so it really doesn't matter which calculator you have 991 ES or 991 EX. since both of them have the same 991 but one is ex classes one is the es natural vpam now the another but the difference here the difference between all from all the three calculators is that this is 252 functions this is 417 functions and this i think is more but i have no idea so comment down below which how many functions does this calculator have but another difference is that this the calculator i'm holding at the 991 ex is more advanced more modern compared to this and this which makes it easier to uh, execute a executor answer um with the the program or the query you have given to the calculator uh, also 991 ex is much more broad you can do what both the calculator both the 991 es plus and 85 es plus cannot do 
one of them of course is scanning the QR code and getting the answer in a smartphone or a tablet with 991 ES and 85 ES plus cannot do it at all also um, they also have options a mode which is very unique compared to 991 ES plus and 985 ES plus where the options are in rows instead of in columns but both the calculated ES pluses have in columns another difference is that it has three functions and three setups and this has eight or the ex plus also has eight um ex plus is much more modern and i would recommend people to use this calculator if you are in higher year and you really really want to excel in your studies so I, I would recommend people to use EX Plus since it's very, very amazing. It's more modern, more setup, more functions to be used, and it's very, very useful in your university careers. But in university, you have to also use the graphical calcula calculator, I'm sure, since there are very various questions depending on graphs, and you have to use a graphical calculator. But one thing, graphical calculator is really expensive, and I really don't do. Um, using graphical calculator since I don't have it right now but I will do it of course um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video uh, if there are any other differences please comment down below make sure to hit the like button since this is my first ever video on technology um, anyways take care